All right, guys, wish me luck. Jess, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having an amazing day so far. For today's video, I am doing something fun here on my channel and it's Instagram controls my date for a day. So today I'm going on a date day with my husband. I know a lot of you guys have already met my husband, but in case you haven't. Behold, my in and out shirt. Look at the pocket. It's oh, you're gonna have cup. to change out of that. Yeah. It's so cute. I but it's it. still cool and I wanted to show I'll it show off. show a close up. Look at that. Look at that cup pocket. Isn't that like the coolest shirt ever? Yesterday we put up the polls because I wanted there to actually be enough time for people to vote. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, you're so tall, bub. First thing that you guys decided on was what I should wear, and then the next thing was what he should wear today. Food. Food. And then we have a place to go, and then it's an activity. Yeah. And then who's making food? For dinner. Before I tell you guys what outfit won, I want to show you guys all of the outfits really quick. And I also want to say that today's video is actually sponsored by Revolve. Like, what? Super exciting. And all of the outfit options that I show you guys are from Revolve. If you guys want to shop them, you can down below in the description. I will leave links for everything. I have always heard such good things about Revolve. And then when I got this order, I was just like genuinely shook at how much I really like these clothes, how well they fit, and the quality they felt. Is there any outfit option you're hoping wins? Mm, I want to pet that one really soft one all day, so I hope you get the soft jacket. Otherwise, you look really good in the dresses. Wow, thanks babe. This is outfit number one. It is this super soft black turtleneck paired with these black pinstripe overalls. And there's actually like this fun little detail. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but the pinstripes are not actually white they are pink and green and it's super subtle but in a very fun way got all cosmo and wanda up in here and for shoes i would wear these black heeled chelsea booties i really love this more like monochromatic look outfit number two is definitely on the bougier side but i think it's so cute this jacket is everything i i really love it consists of this nude lacy cami paired with this super soft super cozy jacket. I wish you guys could reach through the screen and feel this because it's so, so soft. It legit feels like a puppy. It is that soft. Paired with all this, I am wearing these black faded mom jeans. And for shoes, I'm just wearing these pretty basic black loafers. I feel like there is a bit of a bias towards this just because I love this jacket so much. Outfit number three is a bit different than all of the other options. A little bit spicier, it's that pop of color. You guys know I love my neutrals, but I decided to throw a little bit of a wild card in here. This blue floral dress, it has ruffles all over. It's asymmetrical in both the sleeve as well as the hem. And overall, it's just like a saucier, spicier number. For shoes, I would just wear these basic nude heels. And for outfit option number four, we are going for a classic with a little black dress. So this dress, even though it is, you know, the little black dress classic, does have some fun details. First off, there is the square neckline that is so trendy right now. And then along the neckline, as well as the arm, there is just this really thin, delicate lace. I feel like this is the most awkward angle, but the back is open for a pop of skin. I wanted to dress this down a little bit, so I've paired this little black dress with white sneakers that have a little bit of cheetah print going along the trim. So now that you guys have seen all the outfits, let's pull up the poll. The option that won was the fluffy jacket, the cami, the black jeans, and then I'm pairing it all with black loafers. And that is the outfit. This is the one I wanted to pet. <laughs> this is gonna be my day. Winning with 56%. We have your watermelon button up. Oh, I was not expecting that one. Really? I kind of thought people have seen the watermelon shirt and would have picked the other one, but I guess we have different audiences. So That's true. So they wouldn't have seen that I wear blue shirts in every one of my videos and every day of my life. 30 blue shirts, like all of his shirts are blue. Should I strip on camera or off camera? Let's, let's give the people a show, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, whoa, babe, all right. <laughs> babe, let's see this fit. Ooh. Bring in the sauce. <laughs> You're cute. Thanks. Now for the question that I have all been waiting for. What are we eating for food? We are having, oh my gosh, this was so close. It wow. was 48% breakfast burritos and 52% acai bowls. Thank goodness, because I really want acai bowls today. That sounds good. And we should also see what we're doing after that, because 
if we... Oh, because we have to either know if we're taking it like to go. Yeah, if we're taking it to go, then we should bring our picnic basket. I'm kind of hoping that the observatory wins. I'm hoping the arcade wins. I don't I, really I arcade. know you are. Oh! 62% oh. voted for picnic, 38% voted for eat and then arcade. Boo! So looks like we're going on a picnic, babe. Let's go grab our picnic basket. After a year of marriage, we are finally using one of our favorite wedding gifts. And it has plates. And then it also has like a full roll of utensils. So we just parked, we're walking over to our acai place. And she looks so bougie. I feel so bougie, because this is totally something I would wear, but like I'd probably wear it not early in the morning. It's because it's it's pretty early right now. It's time for Sunday <laughs> brunch. <laughs> you feel normal because this is something normal for you. This is something normal for me. I always look good. True. I just had a, such a fun idea that we want to do in life. It requires us to live in like these million dollar like villa looking houses on these Hollywood streets, but they look like these like Spanish style telenovela houses. So They're so do pretty. Is we would we would buy one, we would live in it. And our vlog would consist exclusively of us speaking in Spanish and recreating telenovela scenes. Update, we drove up to the observatory. The parking lot is full, so they the parking people directed us down the hill. And like, we're quite a ways down the hill. We're like half a mile down this hill. Wearing heeled booties, so these are not really great for hiking or climbing up or walking, I don't know, long distances. Is exactly why I was like, please pick an arcade because it's a <laughs> Sunday in LA when it's just starting to get warmer. This is all bad. Are you gonna try and make a U-turn? Are you gonna be that guy? I'll be that guy. Oh yeah. Let's make a U-turn on a one lane highway on a cliff oh, in Los Angeles. I'm a wizard. We turned around and we parked. There were plenty of spots. They just weren't letting people in from one direction. So we went the other direction. But See, I thought it was like a big field, like a college campus where like people are just gonna be sitting on their ass hanging out with their dogs and stuff, but like it's just a photo spot. Everyone's gonna be staring at us and taking pictures of us eating. <laughs> Look at LA. There's like nobody sitting, like not even people with their dogs. But so I feel like it's gonna be super weird if we sit. Like do we just go for it or do we try to find like a bench? Our acai is probably getting melted, so we should make a decision pretty quickly here. <laughs> Pop alert! Alright, you figure out how to sit up there so I can take a picture of you. Whether or not we do parkour later, we're doing parkour now. <laughs> oh my god, I pulled my hamstring and it hurt. You pulled something? I think I did. Wade helped me down and I guess my belt was like against. It just cheese grated my nipple and sliced it off my torso. I'm sorry, lovey. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh. We're gonna own it. I used to use this sheet as a projector screen in high school. So now it's just like my, my throwaway sheet for random things. It's all torn up. Wow, what a dream boat. Oh, oh it's wet. It is wet? It's wet. Oh, that. bump. Oh, it's, it is wet. Maybe we can find like a bench somewhere and just sit on the bench. That sucks. We found a choice bench it with a nice scenic overlook. There's literally nowhere else to sit. Looks That's pretty right. okay. I guess these start out so cold anyway. This is our view. See, we're close enough. Yeah, my, my, my lover, I think I'm falling for you. Adore you, the universe empty without you. Don't think I ignore you. Such royalties hard to find. Your design is refined, one of a kind. Unwind. So we just got home. We battled with traffic for ever. And now we're home. And the winner of our next uh, activity thing to do, it was 58%, was try parkour. 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 If you guys did not know, my husband is a parkour pro. He is so good and he can do all those things that you see in movies. Because she can't do vaults because her wrists are yeah, not in good conditions. Yeah, my wrists are all like messed up from cheer back in high school. Yes, and so. she didn't have the upper body strength for rail work. So we're going, we're going flip. And I'm also going to make him do a bunch of cool stuff so we can impress you guys and you can be like, wow. 
Also, one side note I'd like to make is I'm really surprised that only 58% voted for parkour and 42% of people voted for watch a movie. Yeah, we can't even share that with you. Why would you want that in a vlog? If you voted for watch a movie, tell us why. Yeah, we're I just like know. genuinely curious. Now we are at the Tempest Free Running Academy in Northridge. It's a parkour gym. Yeah, this should be interesting. I don't really know. Do you have like plans on what you're gonna try and make me do? Um, backflip. No, I don't know. Oh, I can't backflip. Okay, we have to go inside though because it's so cold. Looking cute. Look, I'm ready to parkour. Let's see your backpack. Yep, looks like a parkour backpack. Does this look like someone who's about to try and do parkour? Uh, yes, yeah, so you much. Think I'm yes. gonna stand out. <laughs> Probably. I'm totally gonna stand out. People are gonna be like, "What the heck are you doing?" First thing is we need to stretch or work ourselves. I also have a crick in my neck, so I'm like afraid of how this is gonna go. And I'm super sore because I worked out twice yesterday, so my body just kind of feels like spaghetti. -y. This inflatable mat is the first obstacle. You're not supposed to walk on it with shoes, so the question is how do we get past it? Okay, I'm gonna go. All right, go, go, go. <laughs> Is impressive personalities expressive war is festive spirits are lifted on your neck you don't got nothing yeah. check it out princess with the heart to match fragile like an artifact this world dark got a part guys i have to show you something we just drooled when he fell <laughs> sitting here for the people never been deceitful you're my equal my love I think about you more than you imagine. Both for the dreams, come and sail with the captain. Tell me what's your destination. We'll leave right now without a hesitation. Or if you'd rather elevation, love, we can float through the skies. Take my hand, close your eyes. No one is surprised. I see the moon when I look into your eyes and my song. That was awesome, babe. <laughs> so, first, I just want you to jump in, see how it feels like. <laughs> I don't know what I expected, but I didn't expect that. No, my socks are being sucked off. Wait, <laughs> you're pulling me. There's a lot of socks that get lost in the pit. <laughs> Wait. Oh no. <laughs> I told you. So squat, stretch out, and tuck. Can I see you do one as like an example? <laughs> you got it, you got it. <laughs> I cannot get over being scared to flip. We have like five minutes left, so I have to get it like super soon. Otherwise, I'm just not gonna do it. And I'm so determined to like do this one thing. I'm not gonna ruin our date day with me not being able to flip. You got it, baby. <laughs> Yay! That's pretty good. Really? I don't think I jumped enough. If it were the real ground, you probably would have smacked your face. <laughs> but that's what the foam pit is for. You did your flip, so as promised, I'll do it off there. <laughs> so, what'd you think? Well, obviously, I'm not very good. It took a long time for me to get like psyched up. I think here was a lot more was a lot taller than I remember everything being. Um, but overall it was good. I was able to do one, I think, semi-successful flip. Like, it, it, it happened okay. Um, it wasn't anything that you're gonna send me to the Olympics for, but like, you know, I did more than I imagined I would really do. And that's all anyone can ask for in this life. <laughs> Mwah, you did good. I'm proud of you. Woo! And the lighting nice. It is, it's so pretty. It looks so good. You look good, I look sweaty. Now we are uh, off to shower and get changed and time for dinner. Yeah, we'll see who's cooking. Oh man. Hello guys, it is the next day and I'm currently editing the video. So 
I'm gonna give you guys a very realistic look at our life and just kind of like adulthood in general. So basically yesterday when we got home from parkour, we were exhausted and we decided to sit on the couch, watch a movie, chill before dinner because we weren't really hungry yet. And um, we ended up falling asleep till three in the morning. And then when we woke up, we both were really, really tired. So we decided to just go to bed. And then the next day we were planning on filming it in the morning and then just kind of like faking it. And then it didn't happen because my husband left right on to a business trip to San Francisco for the week. So it just didn't work out. I'm really sorry. Uh, but if you guys do want to see my husband cook me dinner and you want to see maybe like a part two to this or something, um, leave a comment in the comment section down below. I'm sorry there's no like actual ending, but I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was a lot of fun to film. Obviously, I'm a flop when it comes to uh, parkour so i'm definitely probably not going to pursue that in my future but overall it was so much fun and usually like it's so easy to get into a routine of like what kind of things you do so it was really fun to do some different things and try different things and actually go out both of us usually work from home so it's really just easy to not leave so it was nice to leave and go out and do stuff and just like I don't know, it was nice and romantic. So thank you guys so much for voting and being a part of this video. Again, another huge thank you to Revolve for sponsoring today's video. If you want to shop any of the outfit pieces I shared in the video, I will have links to everything in the description box. So go check them out. And that's kind of it for today. So thank you again. I love you guys lots and I will see you in my next video. Bye.